Hey everyone, this is Angel from Apex Gaming with a brand new video for The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. For more guides and walkthroughs of the game, please check the playlist in the top right corner of your screen. In this video, we'll give you a quick walkthrough of the Giza Crater Crystal Shrine quest in Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. In case you haven't triggered this quest, you can do so by going to the region west of Central Hyrule and finding the Giza Crater. Here you'll notice a spot for the Itakak Shrine, but the usual big rock that emits the green smoke is missing. Interact with the shrine and you'll trigger the quest. To complete this, you'll need to bring back green crystal located inside the Giza Crater, so just follow the green beam to find it. To get this thing out of the cave, we're going to use two rockets that are found inside the crater and also a metal chest that's being buried nearby. Get the crystal from its spot near the ice likes with the Ultra Hand ability and let's start building our creation. I made this kind of weird SpaceX prototype where the rockets will give the necessary propulsion to get the crystal out of the cape, while the chest stabilizes the force generated by the rockets so it doesn't fall over. Uh, trust me, I failed miserably before. Oh, and by the way, rockets are single use, and they will disappear after they run out of battery, so in case you get stuck with no rockets, fast travel to a faraway shrine and then fast travel back again to the crater to make them reappear. Now it's just a matter of aligning the rocket chest crystal ship with the crater hole, ignite it and go back to the surface to retrieve it. Finally, bring it to the shrine so it can now be complete and you can enter to get your rewards. Be sure to check out more Tears of the Kingdom videos that I will be uploading to his playlist right here as a progress for the game. But for now, I hope this was useful, thank you for watching, and keep enjoying the game.